Hello and welcome back to Pokemon Sky with me, Kratos, where today we are where we left off. Let's go to the director's office. We are right where we left off in the last episode. Just completed the Starfall Street quest path thing and Director Glover wants us to have a quick chat with him in his office before we head off to the Pokemon League, which we will do today. Right, let's see what he's got to say. Thank you for all your hard work with Team Star. All good, my friend. Today we're going to do the first two, at least, battles in the Pokemon League. So let's uh, get this bit over with. Come on, Penny. What have you got? Hey there. You'd like to work on the STCs with Team Star. But... Because of the other really bad thing. So you did something terrible, huh? You know the LP I gave you? I got a hold of it illegally. Oh, cool. Loads of illegal LP. Well, that's interesting. I'm assuming we can still use it. I'll have to ask you to give us some privacy. Oh, Penny's on the phone. Hello. What do you want to talk? Come and meet me in front of the school stairs where we first met. I'll be waiting. I've got to get to the Pokemon League. But we'll have a quick chat with Penny. Oh, hey, Penny. What's up? Six of us came up with a catchphrase, hasta la mista. Very cringy indeed. They're letting you off easy. Well, that's great. They'll waive my debt if I do some volunteering engineering. Very cool. The whole like, oh, I'm a hacker, so I can make the system better type thing. Thank you. No worries. I did save Team Star. Sweet. And we get Dracula and Meteor. Nice. One more thing. Repay the debt. Perfect. Why don't you come into Area Zero with us in a bit? See you, Penny. So that's Starfall Street completed, completely completed now. So let's head on over to the Pokemon League. Actually, I guess we could fly because we've been there before. Yeah, there it is. Let's check it out. Okay, so here we are. It's Pokemon League time, boys and girls. And I think I can see someone at the door. I can. Hey, what up? It's Gita. This is it. You've decided to face the Pokemon League, the final test, before we become a champion. Perfect. Best of luck. Thank you. Let's get to it. I feel like we're ready. Pokemon are about level 66. Let's check it out. We got Meowskarada. Yeah, they're all 66. Baxcalibur. Graphii. Farigiraf, Pormot, and Tinkerton. Hopefully, they're good enough. I guess there's only one way to find out. I have a total of eight gym badges. We may proceed to the interview. Ooh. Um, hello, we're here for an interview, apparently. Have a seat. Okay, Rika. Thank you. I shall. Some. Oh, so there we go. Perfect. <laughs> Come on. Good first impressions. It's an interview. The first por portion of the champion assessment. Let's see how many gym badges. We got all of them. Don't worry about that bit. Nailed it. Next question. Please think carefully. As I may automatically fail. Come on. How do we get here? I. Came by a flying taxi. 
Very good. And the name of the school? Uh, Naranya Academy. What brings us? Um, I came to be the champion. Yes, indeed. Oh, phew. And what do you intend to do? Um, I want to become even stronger. Sure, why not? Which of the eight gyms gave you the most difficulty? Um, I'll be honest. Most of the gyms were, were all right. I literally can't remember. <laughs> Let's say Alpha Nada, sure. And what was the name of the gym leader? Um, uh, hopefully they're all in order. Tulip. I don't remember, my dude. Oof, got away with it. Do you remember which type of Pokemon it was? Probably the Psychic, I think. Wow, oh, phew, nailed it. I had to hold my breath for a second there. I mean, we steamrolled at pretty much all of the gyms, so I didn't really pay much attention. And what category was the Pokemon? The, it was the Grass Cat. We know that one. That's an easy one. Gonna repeat the previous question. Uh, I, yeah, I wanna become stronger. Ah, yes, that's right. Well, I mean, you're asking me the question. That can't be a wrong answer. Okay, final question. Do I like Pokemon? Yes. King? Is that the right answer? Oh, good job. We nailed it. I think we passed the interview, hopefully. Congratulations. All right, we nailed it. First try as well. Oh, no one's done it since Nimona. I mean, yeah, some of the questions were not easy. Now we've got an elite test which means facing the Elite Four in Pokemon battles. This is what we knew. This is what we wanted. We're the best the league has to offer. Facing them in a row. We have got a lot of potions and stuff, so if we do have to go straight from one to the other without healing, we should be good. Now we gotta go to the room behind you, eh? Okay, folks, here we go. Battle number one in the Pokemon League Elite Test. It's a nice arena, but who will we face? Oh, it looks like it might be Rika, who just gave us the interview. Oh, it will indeed. It's Rika. Here we go then. of the Elite Four, this is it. A Whiskash. Well, Miascarada will hopefully be able to take on a Whiskash. Don't give up too soon, I will try my best. Are we ready, boys and girls? Let's do this. I'm gonna hit with a Leaf Storm to begin. Nice, super effective. I forgot Special Attack harshly fell with that one. That's not ideal. A Camerot. Um, could probably stick with what we've got, but because we lowered our special attack so much, we'll switch out for Tinkerton. Okay, here comes Camerot. What a beast. All of my attacks are not very effective. Hmm, I didn't think about that bit. But we are still level 66 and camera up to level 57. Tinkerton is getting drowsy. See if we can hit a Gigaton hammer before we go to sleep. Oink. Oh, that was so close to knocking it out. And there goes Tinkerton falling asleep 
right on cue. Um, let's just <laughs> try and tank a couple of hits while we're asleep and hope for the best. Oh my god, Fire Blast is not good. Not for a Steel type. Please wake up. Nope, we're in trouble. Alright, we might lose Tinker Ton here. I'm sorry, kiddo. Alright. One each we've lost now. What will be our next move? Ooh. Now we've got a super effective one in here. Not that we'll need it, I don't think. Let's try and finish it with a crunch. Nice. 2 1. What else you got, Rika? Ooh, Dog Trio. Let's stick with what we got. So it looks like we're getting ground type Pokemon here. And I'm going to try a Psychic. Sandstorm. Hmm. That should be fine. Oh, so close. Ah, yeah, that was hardly anything. Hopefully we can finish you with a crunch. Oh, we used an earthquake yourself. Good job, we're a tank. See you later, Doug Trio. That makes it 3-1. Still getting knocked by that sandstorm. A Don Fan. We'll stick with what we got again. Come on, Don Fan, what have you got for us? A level 57. I've just noticed that Rika only has five Pokemon. Whack you with a psychic. Another earthquake. God, giraffe is a tank. Can we finish this with a psi beam? We can. Cool. I think we've done more than enough damage with our buddy giraffe and a hoodie. And we get two levels up there. Uh, Clod Psy. We're going to switch out. And I guess we're going to try with Baxcalibur. Probably not by anything super effective, but it's such a beast that we should be able to do this fairly comfortably, I hope. Let's do this. Hey, you called me kiddo. Alright, Clod Sire. Kind of a cute Pokemon. Oh, we are actually super effective. Sweet. Ice Beam it then. Oh, of course, because it's got like, it's a double type thing, right? That makes sense. Looks like we're going to have to battle with this terrestrialized Pokemon in all of these as well. Which is fair. Done it throughout the entire game. Why would it change now? But that, is that the ground type one? Oh, he's protecting. That's fair. Hopefully we can hit you on the next turn. Oh, and the sandstorm's gone as well. I was going to say with the sandstorm we've got leftovers, so it should be fine anyway. That was awesome. It was a critical hit though, so we might not be able to knock it out in two. Things are about to get a bit shaky, are they? Oh, it's an earthquake again. Yeah, we're going to tank that a little bit. Some nice leftovers as well. Take us back up to 182. Can we finish it off? No, apparently not because it's going to protect again. Brilliant. Come on, Baxcalibur. Be nice if there was a chance that we could go through the protect. But at least we get a little HP back, I guess. Anything to delay is fine for us. Alright, here goes that Ice Beam. And there goes Clod Sire. Beautiful stuff. That's one out of four. Ow. And the question is, do we have a chance to heal up? Or do we just move straight on to the next room? <laughs> Reluctant clap. Great battle. Felt good to lose. 
felt good to win, to be fair. Stay on your toes. The second of the Elite Four is stronger than me. Oh, it's Poppy. Are we just going to straight into it, Poppy? Because I've had two Pokemon knocked out in that last one. Okay. Time out. Time out for a sec. And folks, here we go. We're going to take on Poppy of the Elite Four. This is trainer number two. Out of four, I assume. And then a champion. But your Pokemon are super, super tough. Can't wait for you to meet my friends. What type you got, Poppy? Here we go. Poppy sends out a Copper Raja. Right, Miascarada. Let's try not to destroy our own <laughs> special attack this time. Smush him. Um, I'm gonna Night Slash. Not bad, just under half. I can take that. Although Stealth Rock is not ideal for us. They might be switching now. Let's try another Night Slash. Oh, so close. Ah, you missed. You want to see how to use a play rough? There you go. That's how you do it. I'll see you later. One down already. How many Pokemon have you got, Poppy? Corviknight. Oh, I know exactly who to send out for you. Your worst enemy. It's even become a meme. What up? I like the way she throws a little Pokeball. Oh yeah, the point of stones. Um, so Poppy also has five. Ready. Oh. Apparently that's not very effective, not ideal. Defense rose sharply. That's cool, we can tank you. Give me a bit more HP back, please. Thank you. Oh my god. This is a lot of defense you've got going on. I think Draining Kiss is our only special we've got, so. Looks like it's going fine. Corviknight's down to health. Oh my god, Bonnie Press was insane. Maybe this wasn't the fun I thought it was going to be. Tinker Time has not been doing very well in this Elite Four challenge so far. See you later, mate. No worries, kiddo. Everything will be fine. Looks like Paul Mott is our way to go. Ready, pull him up. Oh yeah, I got stabbed by the stones. Hit it with a discharge. See ya, Corviknight. That's what we should have done for the game. I feel it was always going to be super effective, but... Oh yeah, we got the Shell Bell. I forgot about that as well. I should really pay more attention. A Bronzong. Ah, we'll stick with what we've got. You're going to steal. Dig. Oh no, he can levitate, I've just realised. This was a mistake. Well, never mind. That was a waste. Oof. Super effective as well. Let's just use a discharge. Well, not so bad. And paralysed, perfect. Is bronze on a steel? I feel like it's a steel, but it's definitely a psychic at least. And that was huge. Poor mod's out. So this one's a little trickier than Rico, I guess. Let's get our giraffe boy back in. Looks like this is gonna be the one to carry us through. 
punch here. Nice. Let's see what runs on. Alright, who's next? Magnezone. Awesome. Very cool. Never faced against one, apparently. But we'll hit it with a psychic. It's always a strong move. Apparently not in this case, though. Not ideal. What about Crunch? That uh, was okay. Hey. Psybeam. We haven't gone for that yet. Uh oh. Good tankiness. God, that did nothing. Crunch it. Or not, we could just die. Oh, this is getting spicy now. What have we got left? Um, we do have a few. Let's try Miascarada. Although I'm a little bit concerned. Okay, what have we got? Let's try a flower trick. Nice, it was not very effective, but still took it out. Thanks to a critical hit, perfect time for that one. We still got three left. We'll be fine. Light screen warps off. It's worn off. Now you've got a tinker turn. My last Pokemon will turn things around. This might be true. I guess it's time to find out. We need to remember we've got loads of heal items. So we'll be fine. I'm gonna terrestrialize and flower trick. Come on, we're like 10 levels high, that will be fine. Come on, Meowscarada. Time for you as well. Now we've got a battle on our hands. See how much this flower trick does. Not bad. It's not very effective, but it's not bad. Very rough. We managed to survive. All good. This flower trick has done us well. Let's try it again. Oh, it's so close now. Steel Heart Pokemon always get a solid victory, so I'm going to win. Uh oh, God. I was about to say, I don't think so. But that's a huge hit. We're down to two. But we should be able to do this. Oh, God. No effect. Backscalibur, it's all on you then. Here we go. Hit it with a crunch. And that's it. Two out of four complete. And I think we're going to leave it there for today. Backscaller was happy. Poppy's sad. But I think I'm going to heal up once again. And the next episode, we will take on the next two. We're halfway there, folks. I think we can do it. If you think we can do it, don't forget, you can leave a like on this for me. Leave a comment if you think we will or you think we won't. Either way, who cares? We'll find out next week. Until then, take care. I hope you have a wonderful day. Bye-bye for now.